hello guys welcome to my youtube channel in today's video we are creating this iphone 14 banner in photoshop so without wasting my time guys let's go straight into the video first of all let's create the app board go to file select new as you always know i use 1080 by 1080 pixels give it a name set the resolution to 72 and the, maintain the default settings right over here after that click on create so guys i created i created this gradient background right over here after creating the gradient background i set the angle to 117.66 degrees the scale is at 100 percent and that is it for this background after the gradient color i imported image from my gallery on and place it on top of the artboard after that i decrease the opacity to 47 percent and um, that is it for the background so guys after the background what i did next was to create this circles right over here so after creating the circles i set the color to gradient color which is the blue color and the transparent blue color so let's check one of the color codes and see so guys as you can see the color code is 3a hcfc that is it for this one right over here so that is what i did for the circles after drawing the circles what i did next was to add the main objects to on top after drawing the circles, I place the main object on top of the artboard. So this is the iPhone 14 and this is the shadow effect of it. So with the shadow effect, I decrease the opacity to 29% and I and the fill to, to 71%. After that, I created a shadow for this one right over here. After creating the shadow, I came back to this main object and uh, I created and I added effects to it. So as you can see, we have stroke and the drop shadow. So double click on the drop shadow. Guys, as you can see, the size is set to 2 pixels and the uh, opacity is set to 100%. That is for the stroke and the color is set to blue. After that, I added blend uh, drop shadow to it. So as you can see, the opacity is set to 65%. The distance is set to zero. The spread is set to nine. And the size is set to 84%. The angle is set to 92 degrees. Okay, that is it for the uh, effects around for this iPhone. Or for the iPhone 14. Okay, guys. After that, I created... I added these shapes to the design and I created a rectangle for my test. After that, I added a stroke effect to it and I changed the color to gradient color. After that, I added this arrow shape right over here and I started after adding all these shapes and uh, rectangles, I added my test to the Poster. So guys, that is it. Okay guys, so as you can see with the iPhone, as you can see it's in stroke form. So what I did was to, um, let's double click on the iPhone. What I did was to decrease the opacity for the test and increase the stroke size to 2 pixels. And guys, that is what I did. And I got this effect right over here. After creating everything, I applied this hue and saturation to the test or to the poster so that we can get something beautiful like this. Guys, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, like all my videos, make sure you share them. Guys, thank you guys for watching.